You know what sounds good? <laughs> Breakfast. Breakfast. I think we should go to a place... In Townsend. In Townsend? I believe it's in Townsend. That's where we're at. We're in the Great Smoky Mountains, and uh, we're in Townsend, Tennessee, just off of Wares Valley Road. We're actually already there. It's a place called Elvira's Cafe. We thought it was cool. Instead of eating at the same places, we're trying to eat something different. I guess uh, nothing left to do but to do it. It looks really cool on the outside. It looks like a, a neat old like cabin or country store uh, as you walk up to it. And it's on top of a little bit of a hill, which is kind of neat. But we took a look at the menu and it looks pretty darn good. Uh, here, take a look. What do you think? Oh man, we looked over this menu. Uh, I gotta tell you, me and Jessica, we, we decided uh, I'm gonna get the chicken and waffles. Jessica's gonna get the mountain man omelet because we're in the mountains. So, I mean, she's not a man, but she's a woe man. <laughs> Our food came up with these chicken and waffles. Comes with uh, a bit of this hot, hot, spicy honey. So that should be uh, fun. Hope this looks really good too. That's a I'm kind of excited. I didn't mean to touch your biscuit. <laughs> Don't touch my biscuit. <laughs> Jessica's Mountain Man omelet is actually really, really good. I'm trying to show you the inside of it there. Maybe you can imagine what those flavors are like. But it's very savory and kind of late. I don't know what another word is for it. But it's, it's really delicious. Nice and hearty. Hearty? Yeah. Like a mountain man. Also, not Arr. That's a pirate. pirate. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna try a bit of this hot honey that we got instead of syrup. So we'll see how this is. Yeah, look at that. Oh yeah, look at that pour. I got a feeling it's gonna be pretty good. Everything else has been delicious so far, so. Which has just been yours. Yep. Mm. It's fantastic. Not as spicy as I thought, though. But it's ridiculous. How is everything so good? The chicken is super tender, and the, the waffle is cooked super perfectly. Everything is super. So this must be a superhero restaurant or something. Store. Store would eat here. Can't forget about the hash brown casserole. This was recommended by our waitress. She said it was really good. And look at the steam coming off. That's fun. What the heck? This is really good. Everything is delicious. Like beyond delicious. Hey, this place gets a big thumbs up from us. So yeah, old Elvira's Cafe. I gotta say it's pretty darn good. Look at that place. There it is. Looks really cool. Like I said, it looks like a, uh, you know, like a, uh, what you call it, like a country store or whatever. But it's just off the side of the road here. Where's the Valley Road here in the Great Smoky Mountains? In Tennessee. Oh, ooh. Man, even their creek service. Neat. The battling, battling creek. Kind of like me, I'm a bit of a battling fool. Anyways, that food was delicious. This place is really good. I like it. Woo wee! Man, that was <laughs> really good. Holy moly, Elvira's, you did us good. That was a, a pleasant surprise. Food was fast. Yeah. Even though their menu says they're not fast food. Everything was still cooked to order and we got our food in less than five minutes, I feel like. It feels like it was yeah. super fast. But I mean, it says it that they're not fast food, but the food was fast, but that doesn't make it bad because it was some of the best of the things that we had, that I've ever had. Chicken and waffles were delicious. The waffles were beautifully cooked, uh, had a nice dusting of uh, powdered sugar on them. The chicken on there was very tender and the perfect size as well. You know, sometimes you get too much chicken and it's like, ah, you know, no, I got whatever. I don't know if that's a bad thing for some people, but for me, I don't like having too much chicken. The ratio, waffle to chicken ratio, perfect. And you got the, Mountain, Mountain Man, Man omelet. omelet. That thing was delicious also. It had all sorts of stuff on the inside and then it was topped with gravy, which um, is something I've never done before, but it makes sense. So I'll probably do that um, again 
anywhere else I get an omelet because yeah. omelets are like my favorite breakfast option. <laughs> um, and then it's I got like the, the perfect fried... breakfast thing because it's yeah. got all the things. It's in everything. It. Yeah. yeah, in one you don't have to separate it. You don't have to make a choice and you just get an omelet. I'm lazy. Get everything. I'm full and happy. Yeah, me too. So, anyways, hope you guys enjoyed coming along with us and and discovering a, a new fancy, not fancy, but a new fantastic place to eat breakfast, at least. At. I'm sure their lunch and dinner is good too. Hey, thanks thanks for coming along. This place definitely gets two thumbs ups. There's one, there's another. Uh, and Elvira's Cafe, definitely come check it out. Maybe we'll see you there. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.